Boom! Now that's how you get it done. Hey guys, welcome to The Infected. Um, it's a new early access sandbox open world game on Steam. Uh, it looks pretty good. I, I read a little bit about it. It's um, something to do with um, some virus that broke out and then the government was... Um, they were making a, a cure, but the cure went wrong, so it messed around with people's DNAs and created them in, in vam into vambies, which are essentially a mix between zombies and vampires. So the story basically takes place where uh, the parents of these kids that went missing on a camping trip in this area, so you're here to look for them, but I'm assuming because it's early access, story is still in development. So for now, we're just going to stuff around, you know, build a base, build some defenses, have fun, get a look at these vambies. So I hope you guys enjoy it, let me know. And let's begin. Um, so, I did start playing the game prior to this, just a little bit, just to get a, a feel of things. So basically, the game gives you tutorials as per the usual. So you just push down F key, tutorial tasks. So gather stones, gather sticks. Uh, yeah, let's just look for some stones and sticks. There's a stick. So now we can essentially craft an axe. Um, if you don't know what specific items you need to craft, what items you need in order to cra craft the certain item you're looking for, you just go to this little book over here. Uh, you can go to Itempedia and it will show you. you. Just hover over which one you're looking to craft and it will tell you what items you need. So we're going to make the stone axe. You need one stick, one small stone. Uh, which we already, we've already got. So now, in order to craft that, you'd bring up this anvil and hand, anvil and hammer item. So it's close. It's almost like green hell. Just drag over a stone and a stick, and X crafted. So now we can cut down some trees. We don't have to go looking for sticks anymore. Cool. Um. Let's see, stone blade. So stone blade craft, drag that over, stone blade craft, cool. Um, so now we're going to make a pickaxe. So in order to craft a pickaxe you'd need, uh, let's just see, itempedia. So you would need one stick, one stone blade and two fiber plants. So in order to get fiber plants, when I first started I was looking on the floor. <laughs> For natural reasons but so you get plant fibers from cutting down trees you just automatically pick them up so regarding the base building I actually want to build a base near this pond you know water source it's nice and open here um, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna build in the thick areas safety reasons um, so let's just see if we can craft a pickaxe uh, so you drag stone blade fiber plants you need two and we don't have a stick damn it let's just get a stick so you can also get sticks by harvesting the wood um, just right click harvest let's just pick up all of them a uh, crappy thing is that if you leave items on the floor they will disappear so that is a shit thing And fiber. What now? What am I missing? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Wine stick. Craft. Cool. So now we don't have to look for stones either. We can just go and smash up some boulders. Let's just go ahead and do that now quickly. Let's just do this one. So this does give you quite a bit of stone. You won't be able to carry them all. If you carry too much, it slows you down. And um, there's other things that the, the boulders do give you. Um, or one of them, see here you've got, no, here we go, iron ore. Now let's just see how many we can pick up. So we've got a couple of stones there. Um, so I'm not going to, I'm not going to exactly follow this tutorial task because I've got all the stone and I said that when you drop things on the floor they do disappear after a certain time. I'm just going to go ahead and quickly craft a um, storage container. Storage container would be under placeables. Just rotate that. I'm just going to place it here just for now. And that would take four logs. Oh, 
I mean, one of the cool things about this game is so when you hold down F key, it shows you on the bottom right corner your health, stamina, thirst, proteins, carbs, fat, vitamins, energy. So it's got the whole shebang, the whole survival shebang. So you got to pay attention to these things, and when you do get damaged, you, you bleed. So you've got to you've got to um, craft um, bandages and stuff, stop the bleeding. You know, you would, it would show you over here if you've got a bleed where you've got the bleed, and you just grab the bandage, take it over, and repair the damaged area. So it's got some great detail. I mean, that's the the great things about these games. It, you know, it goes. Some of them go into such great aspects of survival. It's really fun. So we're just gonna. Well, what are we gonna store? I think before I store anything, I've got a lot of stones, and one of the things I need stones for is a campfire. I think a campfire takes about 10 stones. So let's just go ahead and craft it as well. I'll probably just craft that here. Check out that pig, it's a wild boar, but that thing is huge and dangerous. Hopefully it just stays away, doesn't bother us. Uh, okay, let's let's make a fire. Campfire. Just make it over here. All right, that takes ten stones and firewood. Firewood you would get from harvesting the logs. So you just right click harvest. Um, I just got to make some space, otherwise I can't carry any of them. Let's just put some stuff in here. Um, it, it sucks that I can't stack the stones, which is kind of weird that you can stack sticks but not stones. But it's fine, whatever. It is what it is. Maybe they'll fix it or whatever in future updates. For now, I just want to make some space so I can carry some firewood. Okay, so I can carry three, and I need eight for this. Mr. Piggy, keep your distance. No, don't do that. One more, and there we go, we've got a fireplace. So now we can hunt, make meat, cook water. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to kill this pig. Um, I just want to see how to make a spear quickly. Fight some pedia spear. One stone blade, one firewood, and five plant fibers. So we'll go ahead and we'll craft that. Alright, let's just get a stone out of here. Now why can't I take a stone from there? Oh sorry, <laughs> wrong inventory section, there we go. Okay, let's craft. Alright, so we need one stick one stone blade and nope, run item and two plant fiber there we go no wrong wrong item what am I missing let me look I think it's five fiber ah okay guys I see what I've done wrong now so I'm not supposed to use this stick I am supposed to use the firewood so let's just get some firewood. I think I'm going to craft two spears because I doubt that one spear would take this pig down.
One spear. Wait, let me just craft this. One, two, three, four, five. All right. Let's see if we can take this guy down without getting injured. Where is he? That's weird. I'm sure I heard him now. There he is. Is that him? No. Just as I get the spears done, he's gone. What did he go up somewhere this direction? Here's a watermelon. I'm just going to leave that there for now. I'll pick that once I'm done making a foundation. Um, okay, let's just go ahead and make a foundation. I'm just going to build one here. Uh, that should be theories. That should be four logs. Let's just see if we can get this guy quickly. Boom! Now that's how you get it done. So just two spears and he's done for. I think we can start this fire, put the meat on and then get crafting on that foundation. Let's see what I need here. Uh, let's see, let's see. Got some sticks. Okay, we got everything we need to make a fire. Let's get cracking. Some tinder. Some wood. Why couldn't I put that? Ah, oh, it's because I didn't put on the fire, damn it. Okay, let's just go ahead and pick that up. Let's just pick these up. No, do you see how it, guys, how it just disappeared now? So you can't leave something for too long. And let's light it. Sweet. Let's put that meat on there. So you'll see on the bottom right corner you've got your stats, health, stamina, thirst, proteins, carbs, fat, vitamins, energy. Which I'm so sure I mentioned before. So I think that this meat, here we go. So minus, okay because it's raw. So we'll just wait for it to cook up and see what it gives us. Okay. Let's just wait for that. In the meantime, might as well cut down some wood and sort out that foundation. It takes six logs for foundation. I mean, I don't want to build in the forest for obvious reasons, guys. Like, you can't see 100% in there here. It's open. I can see what's approaching me. I've got the water to my back. It's, it's hundreds, you know. Yeah, I've got to go a little bit further to get wood, but I don't mind. So the foundation's done. Let's just go ahead and uh, put some steps, maybe. I just want to see. So we've basically done everything here. Finding carbs. So that would be from foraging. Proteins, that's what we did at the pig. Or the boar, whatever. And then fighting technology, so on the map here you've got your Vambi base locations. So this is where your, your, your blueprints are for the technology that you need. But I'm not going to do that right now, I'm going to get this foundation done. And then I think I'll call it quits for this video. But the next video, make some weapons, look at the, the armor side, and then maybe try and investigate one of these areas. And then we'll see how it goes.
We'll just put up the walls as well while we're busy. I like to have windows all over, it just makes it nice. Frame. And then the roof, ceiling. Did it clip in? No. Why doesn't it want to go in? Okay, I don't think I can. I think I would have put the walls on first. Okay, well, let's just do that. Um, Each wall takes about four logs, I think, and this is also four logs. So for now this will just be like a starter thing, you know, um, I'll probably end up putting a fence as well and then once we fenced in and we got, and it feels relatively safe, because I'm not sure when these Van B guys are going to rock up, you know, so, you know, you're going to need a place to sleep for the night. So, small shouts for now, it's more than okay. Um, let's just see if we can do the ceiling as well. There we go. Then we can eat some of that meat, see how much it gives us of proteins, fats, carbs. Let's take a look. Let's see. So, weight 1, health 2, thirst minus 5, carbs 1, protein 20, fat 10, vitamins 2. So, protein and fats, it's pretty good. Thirst, we've got to drink some water. We've got some water, and we can also collect some water by the pond, and we can just heat it up in the dirt, uh, heat it up in that, um, this bucket, container, whatever. Okay, let's go ahead and eat this. So, that gives you a fair amount of fats and proteins. Uh, let's drink some water. So my fire died out. Why? I think maybe... Can't start a fire while it's, it's raining? It doesn't look like it's raining, but anyway, let me just quickly throw a shout over this. Yep, that's fine. No, I cancelled it by accident. Now it's raining. That's another four logs.
Yeah, I should have um, built the shelter over the fire first before I put the ceiling over the house. Alright, let's go ahead and start this fire up again. There we go. Let's go get some water. I hear a sheep. Do you think we could hunt it quickly? Right, let's go get that sheep and then I'll call it quits for this video. Alright, where is he? There he is. Damn, is this sheep more awake than what the pig is? Let's see if I can chase him. Where? Ah, oh, damn it. Well, that didn't work at all. Let's see if I can get him from here. Well, that was a complete miss. Now where's my spear? There it is. This is a sick ass little hill. What is that, a bird? Let's see if I can get this bird. No, it's still a sheep. Come on bro, stop being a little bitch. No. Now where is my spear? There it is. Where did he run off to now? Can't he just stay still? What kind of sheep is this? Oh well, I suppose it is what it is. Alright guys. I'm going to call it quits. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give me a like, subscribe. Um, I, I'm new to this YouTube thing. Um, you know, my first few videos edited were shit. I rushed it. But um, I'm going to leave it there because it's something that I can look back on. Um, I feel like my editing is getting better. If you guys, even if you don't subscribe and you don't like my video, I'd appreciate the comments. Just let me know what I can do to fix it. I am South African. You know, if you don't like my accent, I can always change it. You know, that's not a problem. No, I'm just like, yeah, I can't do that. I can't change my accent, but <laughs> okay. I hope you guys enjoyed. Cheers.